Hello and welcome back to our channel, where we delve into the fascinating histories of some of the biggest companies in the world. Today we'll be taking a deep dive into the intriguing history of Unilever, a multinational consumer goods company that has been around for over 100 years. From soap to ice cream, this company has been revolutionizing how we live and enjoy our daily lives for over a century. So fasten your seatbelts and get ready for a wild ride through the fascinating and crazy world of Unilever. Before we dive into the story of Unilever, let's take a moment to think about how many of its products you have in your home right now. Do you use Dove soap, Hellman's mayonnaise, or Lipton iced tea? Perhaps you make your curry using Konimex or have Ben & Jerry's as dessert. If so, then you're already familiar with Unilever's vast range of products. But did you know that this company has a rich and complex history that spans over a century? From its humble beginnings in the Victorian era to its current status as a global consumer goods giant, Unilever has been at the forefront of innovation and marketing. So let's explore how this company became the household name that it is today. Unilever has its roots in the soap and margarine industries, which were both booming businesses in the late 19th century. In 1885, a young entrepreneur named William Lever started a soap making business in the UK. He began by making high quality soap using vegetable oils instead of animal fats, which was common in practice at the time. Lever was also an innovator in marketing, using eye catching advertisements and sponsoring events to promote his products. In 1894, William Lever and his brother James established a partnership and the company Lever's Brothers was born. This company quickly became known for its high quality soap, which was sold under the name Sunlight. It was a groundbreaking new product and helped popularize cleanliness and hygiene in Victorian England. Lever Brothers also developed a revolutionary new method of distribution, using traveling salesmen to sell directly to consumers. This allowed the company to reach more consumers than ever before, and sales skyrocketed. Meanwhile, in the Netherlands, a group of margarine producers had formed a cooperative known as Margarine Uni. Margarine was a popular butter substitute that was much cheaper to produce, making it a hit with consumers. The cooperative allowed its members to pool resources and share knowledge, which helped them to stay ahead of the competition. Then, finally, in 1929, the English Lever Brothers merged with the Dutch Margarine Uni, forming Unilever. The new company had a diverse product portfolio, including soap, margarine, and other household goods. Unilever's innovative marketing and distribution strategies continued to propel the company forward, and by the end of the 1930s, it had become one of the largest consumer goods companies in the world. Unilever's success in the consumer goods industry allowed the company to expand rapidly through mergers and acquisitions. One of the company's first major acquisitions was the purchase of the US-based Lipton Tea Company in 1972. This acquisition allowed Unilever to enter the rapidly growing tea market and gave them access to Lipton's global distribution network. In 1987, Unilever made another major acquisition when it purchased the British ice cream maker, Walls. This acquisition allowed Unilever to expand its presence in the frozen foods market and gave them access to Walls' well-established brand and distribution network. Unilever's growth through mergers and acquisitions continued into the 1990s, with the acquisition of several food and personal care brands, including Breyer's Ice Cream, the hair care brand Suave, and the skincare brand Pons. These acquisitions allowed Unilever to strengthen its position in the global market and expand its product portfolio. In 2000, Unilever merged with Best Foods, a US-based food company known for brands like Hellman's and Knorr. The merger allowed Unilever to further expand its presence in the food industry and gave them access to Best Foods well-established distribution network. Unilever's growth through mergers and acquisitions has not been without its challenges. The company has had to navigate complex regulatory environments and cultural differences between companies. However, Unilever's commitment to innovation and quality has allowed the company to successfully integrate acquired companies and continue to grow. Unilever has always been committed to innovation and sustainability. In fact, the company's early success can be attributed to its innovative approach to marketing and distribution. Unilever has continued to innovate over the years, 
launching new products and technologies that have helped to shape the consumer goods industry. One example of Unilever's commitment to innovation is the development of its sustainable living plan. The plan was launched in 2010 and aims to reduce Unilever's environmental footprint while also improving the lives of people around the world. The plan includes ambitious goals such as halving the company's greenhouse gas emissions and reducing water use in manufacturing by 50%. Unilever has also been a leader in the development of sustainable packaging. In 2017, the company launched its Less, Better, No Plastic packaging strategy, which aims to reduce the amount of plastic used in its packaging, improve the recyclability of its packaging, and eliminate the unnecessary plastic packaging altogether. The company has also invested in the development of biodegradable packaging and other sustainable packaging solutions. In addition to its commitment to sustainability, Unilever has also been a leader in social responsibility. The company has launched several initiatives aimed at improving the lives of people around the world, including the Unilever Foundation, which supports initiatives to improve access to clean water, sanitation and hygiene. Unilever has also been a vocal advocate for social justice and equality. In 2020, the company launched the United for America campaign, which aimed to promote unity and equality in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic and the social unrest that followed the killing of George Floyd. Unilever's brand portfolio is one of the largest in the consumer goods industry, with over 400 brands spanning multiple categories, such as food, beverages, personal care, and home care. Some of the most well-known Unilever brands include Dove, Lipton, Axe, Knorr, and Hellman's. One of Unilever's most successful brands is Dove, which has become a global symbol of beauty and self-confidence. Dove's Real Beauty campaign, launched in 2004, aimed to challenge beauty standards and promote body positivity. The campaign's success led to creation of Dove's Self-Esteem Project, which provides resources and workshops for young people to build self-esteem and body confidence. Lipton is another one of Unilever's leading brands, known for its tea products. Lipton has been innovative in its product development, introducing new tea blends and flavors, as well as launching ready-to-drink tea products. In addition to Lipton, Unilever also owns other tea brands such as PG Tips and Pure Leaf. Axe, also known as Lynx in some markets, is a personal care brand that targets young men. Axe's marketing campaign often focuses on the idea of attracting women, and the brand has become known for its distinctive fragrances. In recent years, Axe has expanded its product offerings to include hair care and styling products. Knorr is Unilever's leading food brand, offering a wide range of soups, sauces and seasoning products. Knorr has been innovative in its product development, introducing new flavours and formats to cater to changing consumer preferences. In addition to Knorr, Unilever also owns other food brands such as Hellman's and Lipton. Unilever has also been innovative in its product development, launching new products like the Magnum Ice Cream Bar and the Tiff Cleaning Range. The Magnum Ice Cream Bar, launched in 1989, quickly became a global sensation and has since become one of Unilever's most successful product launches. The Tiff Cleaning Range, launched in 1969, offers a range of cleaning products for surfaces like kitchen counters, floors and bathrooms. Unilever has faced a number of challenges throughout its history, including economic downturns, changing consumer preferences, and increased competition. However, the company has been able to adapt to those challenges and continue to grow. One of the biggest challenges facing Unilever today is the issue of sustainability. As consumers became more environmentally conscious, there is increasing pressure on companies to reduce their carbon footprints and improve their sustainability practices. Unilever has responded to this challenge by setting ambitious sustainability goals, such as sourcing 100% of its agricultural raw materials sustainably by 2020 and achieving carbon neutrality across its manufacturing operations by 2030. Another challenge facing Unilever is the rise of e-commerce and the changing retail landscape. With the growth of online shopping, traditional brick and mortar retailers are facing increased competition and pressure to adapt. Unilever has responded to this challenge by investing in e-commerce capabilities and partnering with online retailers to expand its distribution channels. In terms of future growth, Unilever has identified several key areas for expansion. One of these areas is emerging markets, where there is a growing middle class and increasing demand for consumer goods. 
Unilever has been expanding its presence in these markets through strategic acquisitions and investments. Another area for future growth is in the plant-based and vegetarian markets. Unilever has recognized the trend towards plant-based diets and has been investing in brands like The Vegetarian Butcher and Ben & Jerry's Non-Dairy Ice Cream. Unilever has also been investing in technology and innovation to drive future growth. The company has a dedicated research and development team focused on developing new products and technologies, such as its CIF Eco Refill, which reduces plastic waste by using refillable bottles. And there you have it, the intriguing history of Unilever. From soap to ice cream, this company has been at the forefront of innovation and marketing for over a century. And with its commitment to sustainability and social responsibility, Unilever is continuing to make a positive impact on the world. Throughout its history, Unilever has faced a number of challenges, but it has always been able to adapt and continue to grow. Its commitment to sustainability, innovation and expansion into emerging markets has helped it stay ahead of the curve and remain a leader in the industry. So next time you reach for a Unilever product, remember the incredible story behind the company that made it possible. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more fascinating company histories.